That's a big sardine. Big bait, big fish. Yes, sir. Meat is nice and white. You know the fish like that white meat. Water's coming up fast. Stick it in the hole, it shouldn't be that hard. Come on. There you go. I'm in. Wrap it up like, wrap it up like, uh, like King Touch Dog. This is what they did to King Touch Dog right here. Wrapped him up. Wrapped him up and put him in a tomb. Oh, come on. Didn't throw it in the water yet, I'm already tangled. Now that's what you call chunk bait. Looks like something bit it. Let's get it back out there.
Get in the bike, baby. Something was biting it. Look at that. And our magic stream is keeping it on there good. Reuse it. I hope that thing does not get my line. All this debris is becoming troublesome. Too much debris. That should be the last of it. Looks like. Whoo, I'm getting bites. That was a big bite I just missed. It's a big piece of bait I got on there. I'm pretty sure it's still on there. Man, a bait still on there. What's wrong with this fish? Look what he did to my bait. Throw it back out there. That bait looks good. Should I put on a new bait? Yeah, I got plenty of bait. I'll put on a new bait. New fresh bait. Some big chunks. Make sure that uh that 20 pound that 20 pound striper can't resist. Give them some nice big chunks. Don't be skimpy on the bait now. You gotta feed these fish. 
you gotta make it worth their bite make it worth their time you think a little fish is gonna mess with your little the, that little piece of bait that you give them now nah, you gotta give them a big huge piece of nice little sardine a sardine steak sardine entree keep them full for two days the bigger the bait the bigger the fish have you guys seen these stripers these stripers will eat anything they'll eat they'll eat bait that's bigger than them and choke on it and die oh my it's too much debris oh, i hate it when it's like this fighting the debris today messing up my fish fix my bait get it back out there oh nice wide and open now beautiful cast I got a new chopping board. Nice flat rock. Sardines nice and thawed out. Cut through it like butter. It's so, I hate it when it's the, the sardine so frozen you can't cut through it. You gotta use all your strength. And I got this little old knife. I barely gets the job done, but it still gets the job done. Okay, finally, the debris starting to move further out. Finally get the fish in peace. That debris is a headache. Come on. Little pecs, it must be a small one. Sometimes it could be a big one. Oh, oh, there we go. Well, that looks like a big bite. Yeah. Those little slow pulls, those are big fish. Those little quick pecks, those are the little fish. Okay, okay. I'm getting little slow pulls on a black one, but it's only a little pull, though. I need a good long pull so I can pull back. Come on, dude. Okay, okay, there we go. Well, at least the fish sees my bait. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Come on, some more of that. Come on. I needed to, to commit. I needed to take that bait like it like it hasn't eaten in a month. Come on. Okay, okay, still pecking at it. Okay, okay. Nice little pools, come on. Don't stop now. It's been pecking at it for over over five minutes now. Still won't take it. Must be a little one. Damn. Okay, still pecking at it. Come on. Just take it. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Ah, I didn't get him. Damn. It was pecking at it for a long time. The bait's still there. I could reuse it and throw it back. Must have been a small one. Dang, it's so weird how it always bites at the same time. It's like the fish are in sync or something. Poles are biting at the same time again. Come on, come on, come on. They're biting at exactly the same time. 
I don't know which one to yank. The fish are definitely pecking at it, but it just won't take it. Well, at least I know the bait's working. Man, definitely a little one. Check that out. You know that's got to be a little one when it looks like that. Left you the spine only. Is it cold or spine? If there's a bunch of little ones around you definitely got to put some magic string make it a little hard for, harder for them to take your bait squeezing that thing nice and tight Bunch of little ones messing with it. Oh, that looks like a nice size one. Got him. Good show, baby. Feels like a small one. Man, this guy was messing with that bait for a minute. Fish on, baby! Yeah, it's a small one. Oh. Might be a keeper. Putting up a little fight. Ah, small one. A little fighter, though. A good 16. Yeah. <laughs> he was biting on it for like 10 20 minutes. I had a big old piece on there, <laughs> little baby one got thrown back. Yo, dude, stop moving. Good little 16 inch, little shaker. A nice little shaker. Let's get a bigger one. That fish was working that bait for a minute. I say over 10 minutes. Finally got him. Wasn't a keeper, but uh, it was pretty fun to reel in.
Okay, let's get another one. Nice piece of bait. Should give me a nice fish. Ooh, this water's coming up. Oh, my bait flew off. Damn it. That hasn't happened in a while. My bait flying off? That's a rookie mistake. I don't know if these hooks that I got, they're size five, but they seem a little smaller than uh, the usual. Maybe I should buy some starts buying size six, or it was the brand. It was probably the brand. Cause the mustad, I was using the mustad size five. They were bigger than this. The hook would go all the way through the, through the bait, but these ones won't. See these ones, the hook won't come all the way out the other side. These are eagle claw, I think. The mustaches, they would come all the way out through the other side. This one won't, look. The shank or the tip is shorter. They're both size five. Maybe it's just the brand, huh? All right, let's get it back out there. Ah. It's a perfect cast. Is striper season over or something? It seems like all the big fish are gone already. I'm catching them with small ones. 